YouTubers, Bald Rhino back with another incredible PSA reveal. Hope you enjoy this one. A lot of variation. A lot of like, oh my goodness, why does he grade that? And uh, some fun cards as well. Really enjoying uh, helping with my daughter with her homework today. And we're trying to figure out the difference between socialism and communism. And I basically just put it in the uh, into the terms of cards. With socialism and communism, you don't have cards. So there you go. Hope, to, hope that's a good answer for her teacher. The first card here is 1975 SSPC. This is a rookie card from Robin Yount. Obviously, shooting for a 10. Didn't get it. So that'll go into the collection of the cards that are not for sale or can't be sold. But it's a beautiful card. I don't know if you're familiar with this set, but they were the original Rebels. Uh, decided that they didn't need a license to print cards and uh, went for it. They're clean. They're nice. And they're very inexpensive. So I hope that you like that one. Next, this is just a PC item. Um, didn't, wouldn't grade this normally, but I had it as a kid. This is the three Hall of Famer card, Tory, Stargell, and Hank Aaron. This is a PSA 5 of the RBI leaders. It's got Aaron on there, so I kind of want it. It's a very good surface of the card. It wasn't centered very well, but pretty nice. Tory. 137 ribbies. It's amazing. Look at the list of those people on there, huh? Those players are pretty amazing. All right. Uh, as you know, I'm getting ready to gear up, go to the National this year, and here's some cards from the National last year. Sorry about the reflection, but that's the perfect fit sleeve a little bit. This is uh, Rafael Devers. This is the rookie card of the National and a PSA 10. Just a beautiful card. Mm-mm-mm. Next one is the uh, Topps Angels set from 2015, Mike Trout, PSA 10. I don't know if you guys have seen the video online of the uh, Vegas Mike buying all the Trout cards up and paying top price for them. He feels like um, it's one of the best investments ever. and he, it's, an it's an interesting video. I'd encourage you to watch it. Um, this one was a bummer. This is the PSA 9. Again, this is the... It's just as good as the Devers card, but it's Mike Trout. And that means that the funnel's smaller. They're not going to let as many 10s through. And unfortunately, I was the guy that didn't get the 10 on that card. But that's okay. There's a couple examples of that here. Second is the uh, variation. Stadium Club variation there. Running. It was a 9. That was pack pulled 9. So, bummer. Here's a positive though, the batting uh, refractor from the Topps Chrome. That's a PSA 10. Here's another. I think you might enjoy that one. That's the Mike Trout 2012 PSA 10. Here's one of the best pulls I've ever had. Uh, you know, I love the Stadium Club. This is the uh, orange Stadium Club. 2018 Never Compromise Orange. This is uh, numbered. Um, it came back a PSA 10. So that one is nice. That one will be worse than dough someday. I can't remember what the number. Oh, yeah, 5 of 50 right there. That's a beaut. Enjoy that. I uh, have the full 1965 uh, set, and sometimes I find a card that I want to grade. This is Pepitone 65 Joe. Pepitone. It's a tough card to find. The grade is indicative of just how hard, because that card's pretty good shape, but tough to find uh, good grades, and then you don't want to pay too much. Here's another one of the National that I'm just so happy. Now, this is the Gliber Torres Gold Refractor PSA 10. I think this is numbered, to, um, let's see, 37 out of 50. I was with the great Mike O and uh, Dave's Midlife Card Crisis when I pulled this particular card. So, kind of a fun memory there. Here's the Vladimir Guerrero Junior National Convention, PSA 10. Just the base card. I don't know. If I had some cards of this guy, I'd sell them all right now. I, I don't think he's... 
be sure it got a lot of hype. It's hard to measure up to that. All right, some basketball. We got the great Gary Payton. This is the Kellogg's 91 PSA 9. It's only three of them, no 10s. Unfortunately, this was a disappointment. This is the Bird, Larry Bird, college great, PSA 8. The funnel theory there as well. Is every bit as good as the Pey Peyton. Here's an Acuna from the National Convention, PSA 9. Very nice. Derek Jeter, PSA 9 from the convention. Here's a Vern Law, 1954 Bowman. Card was, I think, a, a dollar or something. So, it, you know, sometimes you win, you get really, really lucky. Here's a card from a PC item, Kenny Lofton. Uh, everybody knows I kind of collect Kenny. Uh, went to school with him. He, he's a great, great guy. And he uh, should be in the Hall of Fame. It's kind of a laughing stock. But this is the Stars and Steel card. And it's actually a steel card, PSA 9. Really tough to get these graded any higher than that. But that is a sweet card. Then on the back, you can see... You can see a little bit of the metal. That is a metal card. Very cool. And then lastly, um, will he repeat his performance from last year? This is the Acuna Refractor PSA 10. Sweet. Appreciate everybody tuning in. Take care.